back on the spawn beach. What is going on, gamers? It is, in fact, your boy, Wally1K. And today, boys, we are back again on the Solo Rust adventure. I need to take a second and thank you guys for the support on this channel. Yes, I always say thank you in the beginning of every single video, but this time, I asked you guys for 20,000 likes last video, and we did that in under 24 hours. Right now, I think we're currently at 27,000 likes, if I'm if I'm right. 27,000 likes is something that I've never seen on this channel. It is a record, and it wasn't even on a long video. It was on a 30-minute video. When I tell you guys, I seriously cannot thank you guys enough for what you guys... Ha you guys have changed my life truthfully. Three years ago, I was sitting in a high school classroom, failing all of my classes, and basically, I, I really didn't know what I was going to do in my life. Like, I was I was lost. I'll be honest with you guys. I was, I was a really lost, man. I was. I knew that school definitely wasn't for me, but I really had no idea what was for me. And because of you guys coming back every single week and watching these videos, I have something to look forward to every week. I have a job that I completely and utterly love. I get to, every week, try Try to inspire the youth and I know I'm only 20 years old so you could definitely sit here and say that I'm young and I could be classified as the youth but I have so many people that look up to me and it's just like a feeling that is I can't even put it into words the feeling that I, that I have I, I don't have words for it and I just I genuinely genuinely I can't thank you guys enough you guys really changed my life and I never expected to be where I am at like where I am today and um it's just it's incredible. It really is. So thank you guys. Seriously. And with that being said, boys, we're going to try to get some insane solo Rust content today, tomorrow, and the next day. I want to get a really long video for you guys because I'm very motivated. And I really do want to hit 500,000 subscribers this year. And the only way I could do that is bring you guys literally the best content and keeping it consistency every week. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to work as hard as it takes to put out weekly videos for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoy. And let's get in to this video. Thank you, Rust Clash, for sponsoring today's video. Rust Clash is an online gambling website with game modes such as Case Battles, Upgrader, Plinko, their original cases, Mines, Coin Flip, and Jackpot. If you deposit now using credit cards or gift cards and a bunch of other options, you can get a 66% bonus. You can even use crypto and get a 65% bonus. If you do choose to use the site, make sure you use code WALLY1K to get three free cases. You must be 18 years or older and gamble responsibly. Thank you, Rust Clash, for sponsoring today's video. Okay, so I think first and foremost, we're gonna head to Outpost first. So we'll take this road, and we'll end up going to Outpost. And then Rig over here is taken. So a part of me is saying that we should probably base over by this fishing village, or maybe down here by the snow, close to the fishing village, so I can uh, do Rig. I don't know what the closest red card is, though. Okay, the closest red card is honestly like treatment they're kind of, treatment and arctic are kind of like the same so that's gonna be kind of tricky to get red card but we could definitely make that journey and uh get that done for sure okay i got two satchels so far i've literally gotten two satchels out of these crates is, is this like a sign is this like a sign from the rust gods they're just like telling me to go find a wooden base and raid it we should probably start focusing on getting towards outposts since we already have a hundred scrap i also made myself a nice coffee at 11 p.m., which is awesome. You know, stay hydrated, I guess. Actually, I, I don't even know if coffee hydrates. That might have been that might have been a dumb thing to say. All right, let's go recycle. We actually have a lot to recycle. Oh, wait, do I have BPs on here? Oh, wow. Okay. We have, like, every BP. Why do I even have, like... Why do I have HV bullet learned, bro? I must have went crazy on this server. Oh, my God, bro. I already have a 1,000 cloth. Bro. This recycle run was, like, actually insane. All right, so here's another thing I can buy. Boom. Thompson on the way. Now let's head over close to where these guys live, who took heli. Mostly by, like, harbor over here, though, I want to base. This could be a good spot right here. Tier one, get a bag down. Let's get our marker down. We definitely need to go hit a tree. 
We'll get a box down and then we can go out our Tommy. We're gonna be naked, but it's the best we could do is Tommy naked, so we'll see how that goes. Bro. Oh my god. You know what? Like, that was like really bad. But I literally think I pooped my pants. Like, I, I literally think I, I, I literally think I, I just did. Oh my god. I don't think I've ever jumped out of my chair like that in my entire life. Even the way he like looked behind him, because he was like, is this dude shooting me? <laughs> I'm gonna leave with this one set. Do you have instant bolts in this? No. An L9 shot him at the same time I shot him. An L9 with instant bullets. This should be so much fun. There is a mini inside that sulfur quarry. And there's a wall that's open. Dude. Taking the sulfur and the diesel. F1s and a DB with zero bullets? Where'd the kid with the mini go? Who put the diesel in? I literally have so many questions. Oh my god. Where does that kid live? Seriously, where does that kid live? The kid dork at me has to live like right next to me. Like seriously, he has to be like one of these like two by ones right next to me. Unless that's him on his roof right here that I'm looking at. Then things could get weird. Bro, wait, hold up. The guy who is door at me is collecting eggs right now. He's number four, so it can't be this guy. Only because he deserved it. Now we know that he's not... That's not the guy. That guy deserved it, though. He deserved to die up there. I gotta get out of here. What just happened? Like, what? I heard those shots, and then I saw him, like, I saw him, like, grabbing things, so I knew he was getting stuff tossed out to him. So I waited, and when the second he was done, I shot him. And I just, I knew, I knew that that was gonna be completely loaded for some reason. But like, I didn't know it was gonna be this loaded. This is crazy. We're gonna go right back. Okay. Um, I don't really know what to say to that. This is, uh, this is one way to snowball though. We gotta go back fast. Oh my god. I 
I don't really get that. Why they have the boxes outside like that? Okay, so I think we go run rig now. That's a hazy jackhammer farming. Oh, that's great. I love full Korean names farming with a jackhammer. That always means, like... That just means I'm offline, really. It's, that's honestly what it means. That was basically me just saying, bye-bye, base. I also have a feeling I know, I know who I just killed, though. Pretty sure it's these guys. Thought that would have headshot him. It definitely is those guys. If he's on roof like that right away, looking straight where I just killed him. Dude, they're both on the roof. Well, they're Korean farmers, which is it's good to know. Because if we do end up raiding them for some reason or somehow, they're going to be loaded. Honestly, it's not a bad elite crate. I don't know why they're glitched, but that works. And just like that, you take all the heavies. Very strange. I don't I don't really get the glitch thing, but it happens on some servers, so. Flamethrower. It's pretty basic. DB. Water pipe. Wow, these were awful though. Oof. Okay, honestly, the crate wasn't terrible. I actually need to get home because last video I recorded, there was like a spider in my crib and like I like lost it. Like weird, like it was like weird. Like, the, like there's like no way I could have lost it, but I did. And a second ago, another bug just went across the floor to the same spot and it's gone like i need to like i need to take a little second here and actually figure this out it's like the weirdest thing ever bro i totally gotta get a pest control okay ladies and gentlemen i'll be right back okay ladies and gentlemen i'm back still just so weird okay i think this is all the components Oh, shoot. There's no way, bro, just whiff that bad. Oh, my God. got an L9 or something. Uh, what? Bro.
What did they think they were about to get away with? With that, like, that's not even that much boom. Dude. No way. Dude. Oh, no way! That's busted. Dude, he doesn't even know I'm dead. No way! Bruh! I hit him three times! And I don't even have outside bags. I'm a brick for not having outside bags. But I, I literally hit him three times. So those kids are about to offline raid someone, and I just swooped in and took it. I'm pissed I lost my full HCREM set, not gonna lie. But I mean, those kids are just offline raiding. They kind of deserved it. We got away on my bag timer, because I'm a brick. Oh my god, bro. Is it over? It's over. It's over! And I couldn't even get a bag down. I couldn't even get a bag down. It's over. And I couldn't even get an extra bag down. No! No! Literally no! Oh my god, no! It's over for us, boys. It literally is. We're done for. We just got on the server, dog. How'd they know it was me? Oh my god, wait. The one kid who killed me is a level one with three friends, bro. One game ban on record. 88 hours in Rust. Let's see, moment of truth. Is my base gone? Come on. It's not. We need to start preparing right now. Because truthfully, it's bad to be gone. We also need a furnace crafted. Furnace strat is everything right now. They're geared out there. I just don't have legs. I gotta pee so bad.
Oh my god. What? Why was he coming over with just a launcher? Oh my god. Oh, there's, there's a lot more. Oh my god, dude. I don't even know what to do about this right now. Dude, I rocketed all of them. Oh my god, bro. This content's insane. There's three of them. There's three of them and one up the hill to bolt. That's not them. What is going on? Alright. That was, a. Uh... That was a dumb play. <laughs> we gotta get outside bags down. This is just like absurd. I can't do anything. Okay. Let's not do that. Okay. One's dead. I can't upgrade that to metal yet. They have expo ammo. I just heard expo. Nine rockets, 4C4? I know these kids have, like, a box of boom. More. Dude. Did they, like, quit? I hear no movement in their base. Is this their main? What? I hear so many mixing tables going off in here. Is this where the boys cook? Is this where they're cooking everything? <gasps> Dude. Imagine all their farms in here. I feel like it totally doesn't make sense. But I heard multiple in there. They're still online, and I see none of them in their main. So it's like, I don't really know. This just got like a whole lot more intense, because now I know that base that they're in right now, I can raid that. Like with the boom they just gave me, I'm more than capable of raiding this one. All I need is confirmation it's them, and I'm booming it. Four rockets, maybe eight after that. I only have nine. I hear metal. It's definitely... After honeycombing, it's definitely more rockets. It's 
totally just kind of answered my question. It's for sure sheet metal after this. And it is their base, Addington. Okay. I'm in here for good. I'm like really in here for good. Dude, how much fucking loot do these guys have? This is actually crazy to know right here that they have this kind of loot sitting here. Why? I don't know. Oh. Okay, we're gonna try something really stupid. This is what you guys would want, so I'm gonna give you it. I don't even need like a crazy gun, I don't think. I know this is what you guys would want me to do. This is exactly what y'all would want me to do right now. We're gonna go for those boxes. The tier two is worth it. Why do they now come out AK though? Dude, where? Quite literally, where did any of my bullets go there? There's a lot of H-crims there though, bro. Dude. Why did the L9 shoot me? I was trying to help. Like that was bricked. That was a, that was a brick play by them, bro. Like actually.
doubled him. Oh my god, dude. This actually might, like, this content's, this content's insane. At this point, dude, like, this is just getting so crazy. I can't even wrap my brain around this. But honestly, I know what to do now. I know what the next play is for me. And it's not even going to fight. It's not at all. I need to see what HP this is at. A hundred? Four hundred. A hundred. It's at a hundred HP. Like, would three satchels be enough for that? But I'm gonna blow that up because if I blow this up and we can get, like, a flank base going or even depot my loot in that for the night, it would be super, super awesome. Please be enough. Honestly, I'll take it. We gotta blow that TC though. I have mollies, bro. What the hell? Why didn't I bring mollies in the beginning? It's just that, like, I don't have the wood to... Like, I, I kind of have to farm a little bit. It was three wood. That was all this TC had to offer me was three wood. I hope these kids keep fighting over there and I get like a lot of this base done. That's all I need. I forgot I had those doors for like free earlier. Tier two. Let's get that down real quick. Okay, perfect. Okay. We gotta go on that recycling run now. We gotta go on that recycling run that we were supposed to do way earlier. But you know, life had other plans for us. So we need to focus on just getting components for scrap. I could have sworn we had more earlier, but maybe I am like maybe I'm completely lying to myself. I mean that should be enough to buy metal frags and low grade so dude what's also crazy is we got away with almost all of the loot in that bo in those boxes like we literally did it we successfully raided those boxes which is crazy 950 scrap perfect putting that all into the base all of it all right looks good we gotta go back to base one thing about not having your chat on, like, bottom left corner, is that, like, they could totally be, like, plotting against me in chat, and I have no idea, you know what I mean? Like, you'd be like, no, it's the guy, blah, 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 who stole everything, and then I get, like, boomed out of my mind. Also, it's 2.30 in the morning, boys. We start at 11. This has all happened in, like, three hours. I kid you not. Oh, my God. I still got six- I still got- I still kind of got bread. I'm not gonna cap. Oh no, I did this wrong. I wasn't thinking. No, I did this wrong. I wasn't thinking. Why did I do this wrong? Oh man, I wasn't thinking. I wasn't thinking. Whoever let me cook, you shouldn't have. Bad idea to let me cook, bro. My stomach's actually eating itself, so I need to go grab something to eat real quick. And if I come back and I'm raided in the next like five minutes, we're gonna, we're gonna have a problem. All right, I'll be right back in like three seconds. All right, I'm back from eating. Seem to be good. Now we can do some real damage to this team, though, because now we can craft meds. Still on the roof. You know what? While they're still on the roof, I'm going to work on getting this base with a shooting floor, and I want to honeycomb this back side right here, because that just makes it, like, so much more annoying to, like, raid...
These guys have just completely stopped messing with me. After they almost after they got attempt raided, they just they just stopped. I want these down just because like these external TCs. Just because uh I don't want them placing a turret near me. Definitely want to honeycomb this though. Although I could have done wide gaps, there's no point. There really there really is no point for me to do wide gaps because I'm gonna be raided and it's gonna be offline most likely. So this is just so that they can't patch after and so that they can't place a turret at my front door. It's now 3.33 in the morning. I don't know how much longer these kids are gonna be up for, I don't. But I'm gonna fake AFK after I make my shooting floor for like maybe 40 minutes. I don't know. I really don't know. All right, boys, I'm getting really tired, <laughs> but we definitely got to get this down. But I'm tired. I really am. I'm really tired. All right, got the doors down. All right, we're going to fake log, dude. It's it's four o'clock in the morning. I'm so tired, but I don't want to die and lose this base. Or I don't want to go to sleep and lose the base. So we're going to fake log and see what happens. Here we go. I logged off 15 minutes ago. They're laddering up. They just laddered up, though. All right, boys, it's 430. If these kids don't come and raid me in the next, like, 10 minutes, bro... I'm gonna pass out. I'm so tired. <laughs> okay, it's been 10 minutes, but I'm committed. I'm standing up right now so I don't fall asleep. I'm literally standing up so I don't fall asleep. What has my life come to? Now that it's completely nighttime and I see no torch or fire lit, I'm gonna say they're offline. So we're gonna raid this base right here because why not? We have boom. No way. Dude, they are online. Five hundred scraps, not bad. Might as well just hit it from this side. I mean, like, loot wasn't terrible, so I'm not mad about it. And we got a decent flank base out of it with materials that we'll need. Bring some of this stuff over here so that we at least have some fight in us. All right, boys, it's officially 520 in the morning. Um, if we get offline, we get offline at this point. Hopefully we don't, but we do have that flank base now for if we do get raided. We'll have that in the morning, at least. So... So, yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow, and we'll see if, uh, we'll see if we're raided tomorrow, boys. Hopefully you guys uh, enjoyed day one. Well, boys, I stayed up till five o'clock in the morning to be offline raided. That is incredible. Wow. That's crazy. Thank God we got the flank base today. We do, in fact, have enough today to snowball again. So it doesn't really matter. But I'm just... I stay up till 5 o'clock in the morning. And they still offline raided me. I can't believe that. I cannot believe that. At least we got all this, though. I guess we go run rig, huh?
What is that? I didn't grab extra ammo. I think I should depot this instead of looting that Tommy. Oh my god. He might be dead too. No, bro. Oh wow. Okay. And they send their one naked. Dude, how many of these kids are there? Dude, there's like five. All right, let's head towards Rig. That just shows you how bad the gun is. Oh my god. I actually gotta go home. Jeez. What? He came back naked AK? What is going on today, dude? I mean, we definitely lost one AK, but we should depot this and come back. What a day so far, man, for being offline raided. Got more AKs than I've ever had. An AK? Oh! All right, he's doubled, never see him again. There's a raid right at my base, a rocket raid. All right, let's see what we get, boys. Oh my God! Bro! Wait, that giant base is getting raided. F4 is getting raided. Whoa, we gotta go to that. Dude, they are getting boomed. M2 turret. Who should I want winning this? Oh, they're patching. Okay. Not sure my bolts are going. I lagged. I don't even know how that hit.
I honestly can't do much here. The gear's down there, but I'll lose if I go grab it. So, I might as well dip out with the extra AK I got. Oh my god. Oh, they're saying GG, I think, now. Alright, that's over. That raid's done with. Alright, well, jackhammer this out, though. Alright, really scuffed mini garage, but it works. We actually need to raid this base right here. That base needs to get raided. Like, look, we can't even build out. Satchel and I have bean can. Yeah, we could we could satchel raid. We just gotta get sulfur cooking. Alright, we'll take, take a little breather, though. Take a little AFK breather. You know what I was thinking about recently? Rust itself can literally be the biggest game, possibly, like, ever like i don't think you guys understand as a viewer and as a player the potential that this game actually has i could tell you that i've been playing video games since i was oof i don't know my my older cousin actually snuck me modern warfare 2 call of duty when i was six years old so i've been playing shooter games since i was six years old and that actually sounds like kind of crazy that i was playing like rated mature games at the age of six but i was honestly like a pretty mature child and like i've seen like my little cousins who are like i have like two twin cousins that i like love to death like those are my homies they're two boys they're twins and um like seeing them compared to the way that i was when i was like like half their age is actually crazy like i really was a super mature kid and that's never okay to actually let your kid play shooter games that are like at the at that age at all like don't do that but i mean honestly in the end it worked out for me now now i'm a rust youtuber but there is seriously like no game like rust there there really isn't i i've never played a game that is so addicting and that keeps me so excited even eleven thousand hours later and it's like not even that like Yes, the game is great. Amazing game. It, they've really done so much to this game. It's the fact that the dev team that we have behind this game is literally so active. Like, I don't even know how to explain this. Like, we have monthly updates on this game that keeps the game fresh. They're always adding something new. Like, I think next month there's a new monument. Like, they're always keeping this game so fresh. And the game is actually so profitable for the devs that I don't see them like ever stopping monthly updates now if you can give me a game that has done monthly updates and actually at one time they were doing i think like weekly updates at one point or like bi-weekly i don't i don't really remember i've been playing this game since 2013 by the way so or 2014 one of the so it's been nine years i've been playing this game almost wow that's disgusting what dude that just hit me what the heck? That's crazy they have literally been updating this game since then like this game has constant updates that keeps the game going, keeps the game alive, and keeps the game fresh. With this dev team that we have behind us in this game, it has literally the possibility to become the biggest game in the world. Like, 100% hands down. Even the community that this game has is insane. Like, the viewership is incredible when it comes to Rust. Because, realistically, the game is actually really hard. The game's really hard to play. You can't just get on this game and become really good. Especially back in the day with the recoil. Like, you could not just join into a server and join into the game, like, by the game and be good at the game. Like, you had literally had to put in thousands of hours just to be classified as a good player. There's no game like that. I don't know one single game. Maybe, like, WoW. I don't know. Maybe maybe some games I've never played. But shooter games? I don't... I No. I don't know a game that's like that. And I hope one day that I really am, like, one of the biggest Rust YouTubers. Because I, I really do grind, man. I grind a lot. So, seriously, thank you guys for coming back every week and watching these videos. People hate on the devs, but, man, you gotta give them some credit. It's in They're incredible. What are the odds this base is only an 8 satchel raid? Let's figure it out. Oh, What? It's wooden doors. I didn't even know that. <laughs> that thing's gotta be loaded.
Oh my god, it's the kid. Also, like... No. Now I need to make six more satchels. Ugh. That was the kid who was door me in the beginning, though. Honestly? Not terrible. That was a really close call. That was a little too close for comfort. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. Boom. Full vending machine of guns. That is crazy. Wait, are they raiding this f base again? That's the weirdest. Wait. Where's. What is happening? What is going on, dude? Why are they raiding? What's happening? I don't know. I don't know. I just logged on. I don't know what's going on. They got- I countered- they got online earlier. I countered it. But now that's like- But it, I think they're offline right now. Oh, they're totally getting offline rated right now. There's ladders up on the side. That is 17 Why are you waiting till they get offline? They got raided. They got nothing. They got offline. They- they said they quit the server. Now we wanna- Oh. Yo, chill. I gotta just kill them all. Oh. There's so many of them in there. Yo, Sar kid below gatehouse. Sar kid below gatehouse. He's peeking at you. Nice. I have no idea what just happened. Oh. I think I killed all of them in there. I have such random loot on me. But I saw those rockets and I was like, I gotta get out of here. Dude, they're going again?
Everyone's getting raided today. This, what's going on? Stay here, stay here. Or, I mean, like, just stay right here, stay here. You, I mean, I'll give you a uh, hello, hello. We're gonna go counter this. Who's the other guy? Come here, other guy. Take it. One dead. Them. Yeah. Killed one. Yeah, we're good. They're dead. It's them. Nice. It's the. It's right. them. Hi, Wally. I appreciate you. My teammates are dead. Oh, yeah, I know you're in there. Just say hi to me, Kitson. Oh, no. Oh! Oh, my God! Oh my god! Oh my! No! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god, dude, there was so much in there. What the fuck? And I can't get out. No. Oh my god. I can't believe it. Oh my god, dude, that was crazy. I gotta let Steve know Papa's home. Go, Steve. Do you have any boom at all? Dude, it's like one door. Two. It's one door. I was in there. It was three rows of rockets. Two rows or something like that. Our boys... I, I have faith. I have faith in my brothers. Yeah, they added two. They got two now. Oh, That could be a problem. I think one's a garage door too. That's definitely yeah. a problem. Should I check an aid? If only I brought one more rocket. There's a lot on that hill. Oh. <laughs> as long as my boys don't die, we're going to be good. All right. It's the final push for all the loot. I have a good feeling my boys are going to hold this down. Oh, no. It's actually not looking good. One of our men is dead. I killed the kids that killed you. I, I killed the kid that killed you outside. No! Not the rockets! We lost the rockets. <laughs> oh no, my boys went down. I think it's a, I think it's a lost cause. Yeah. Boys, you boys did great.
It was a great attempt. They, it really was. They rocket PvP'd me. There, there was a, there was a kid offering you rockets. I don't know. Nah, it's fine. I got the last. I actually have the last. I had the last three on me and I died right outside. But now I got three on me right now. Uh -oh. But.